Hey, Taylor here with Anti Shanty. I want to show you a little bit about our Wallace heater and stovetop. Come on inside. We love the Wallace cooktop and heater. It's been awesome. It heats the space great and you can cook on it. Uh, to turn it on, you just hold the power button for three seconds. The white lights will kick on. The orange power button will kick on. And that kicks it into startup mode. Startup mode takes around 10 minutes to get hot. Um, so the cool thing about the Wallace cooktop and heater is when it's closed, it's a heater. And when it's open, it's a cooktop. So as soon as you turn it on, you'll hear the fan kick on. Um, and that fan is blowing air across the heat element into the unit. When you open that lid, the fan gets deflected back here. So it's no longer pushing that hot air into the unit as you're cooking. But as soon as you close that lid again, that fan gets blown across the top of the heat element. It's all one heat element. And so when you're cooking over here, you can bring something to a boil and then bring it over here for a simmer. And then if you wanted to heat again, you just close the lid. Some of the awesome features of the Wallace cooktop and heater is it runs off diesel. Um, it's super, super efficient. Uh, so it just sips diesel. There is a two and a half gallon tank up in the front tongue box. You could easily use that around a week's time frame to heat the space. Um, another awesome feature, it is a marine cooktop and heater. So it's using a lot of sailboats, yachts. Um, what you can do is actually turn it on prior to getting to your camp spot or up to the ski resort and you can preheat the space. So as you pull up to your camp spot or your ski resort or wherever you're going where it's cold, this spot, this uh, unit has already been preheated. So as soon as you park it, you come inside and it's hot and warm and ready to go. Another awesome feature is that it reduces condensation inside the cabin because it pulls air for combustion and exhausts that outside. Typically, what we run it at is between one and two on the dial. Uh, and that heats the space really well. Uh, for cooking, obviously, one to two is going to be your low simmer. Three to four is going to be your medium heat. And then five to six is going to be your high heat. Um, so if you want to boil something, you can throw up to five to six, open that lid, and you bring something to a boil right there. Um, if it's super cold outside, typically we run it between one and two. Um, and that heats the space great. You can also regulate the temperature inside by cracking open a couple windows or the vent fan um, because it heats the space so well. Uh, so that'll help regulate your temperature. If it's really cold outside and you're feeling it uh, below freezing, maybe negatives, you just you can crank it up to higher if you want. But all we've ever needed is really between one and two. So we'll just let it run for about 30 minutes. We'll come back outside and check on the temp and show you what that looks like on the battery monitor over here. As you can see, uh, it's not that cold out. It's actually only 51 degrees. Um, internal temp is 59 degrees. Um, and we come back to it, we'll see how much it's gone up and show you that on the Red Arc battery monitor. Man, it's been 30 minutes and it is toasty in here. I gotta take this off. It's gone up like seven degrees since we left it 30 minutes ago. And I'll show you what that looks like on the Red Arc. Um, we started at 59 degrees internal, now we're at 66. Uh, so it's gone up seven degrees in here in a matter of 30 minutes. Um, so it's heated up pretty fast, which is awesome. All right, now that we have it nice and toasty in here, we're gonna shut it down. I'll show you how to shut the heater off. You just hold the power button for three seconds. The white lights are gonna kick off and the orange power light's gonna kick off. The three flames will stay on, indicating that the Wallace cooktop is still hot. Um, and then the fan will stay on as well and help push all of that hot air off of the stovetop as fast as it can so it can do a quick shutdown. Uh, that's a wrap on the Wallace cooktop and heater. If you want to find out more, feel free to go to antishanty.com. <laughs>